Red flag on dating apps. If they have any sort of social media listed, Instagram, Snapchat, they're a no. bot or they're a <laughs> Tamales de the best. Ready? Yeah, that's good, right? Have you ever used like Tinder or Bumble or any of those apps? Okay, cool, cool, cool. What is like your biggest red flag if you see a guy's profile? The biggest red flag is like if you just have multiple pictures of yourself shirtless and like yes. the gym, like uh, girls in the picture. If you have, uh, like, girls in the if no one no wants one to one. see pictures of you and your ex-girlfriend. No. <laughs> if he's holding a fish, not like a regular fish, like a saltwater fish, that's fine. Like but like I said, like she knows her fish. <laughs> like little pond bull catfish and they're holding it up like I do call this and like that? this big I'm like what are you doing with your time I'm going home no no you can't what is like your worst dating experience you've had okay well one time I was dating this guy from my um college and he got arrested multiple times and then got shipped off to Pennsylvania or something and we never spoke again it was prison or stop it Get some help. Let's say like first date, what is your biggest red flag? When they sleep with their mom. Hey yo, what the f Whoa, has that happened? Yes. You mean sleep with like, like go to bed like at night? Yeah, like cuddle. <laughs> if any of y'all are out there cuddling with your mom, seek help immediately. When they're a mama's boy. Have you had that before? Yeah, I have. Yeah, yeah I have. He was just too like codependent on me. He was obsessed with me. If they have to say I'm not toxic, they're toxic. <laughs> yeah, yo. If they even bring up the word toxic, they're definitely toxic. Look <laughs> at her eyes, rip it. They're like. Oh, hold on. No, 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 no. I believe. Yeah, I don't fucking do that. Hold on. Do you find it like attractive when a guy like chokes you in bed? Like if you're having sex. Yeah. Yeah. Is there like such thing as too much? No. I mean, no, no. No, so that's it. I mean, unless I'm passing out. I guess if I'm passing out, then that's the cutoff. Can I show you like about the amount of force that I use? This is the exact amount of force I use, right? I'm all about eye contact. So look, you're going to make eye contact, eye contact. You don't have a lazy eye, by the way. I'm like right about there. Yeah, that's good, right? That's not bad at all. Jeez, huh? I felt tempted to kiss her. Let me, oh, let me. Is it attractive when a guy like chokes you in bed? Yeah, 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 it is, yeah? it is, it is. Yeah. I feel like it depends who it is though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if it's a stranger, it's like, what are you doing? But if I'm like with you, then it's like, all right, bet. There's a certain like force when it's like, you gotta stop, you know? Like sometimes these are like just- Like the right amount. Yeah, like- Have you ever used like Tinder or Bumble or any of those apps? Of course, of course, What yeah. is like your like biggest red flag when you see a girl's her like dating app like when you see her profile come up oh i don't know if she's over six foot oh yeah. shit that's kind of because i'm six foot that's kind of right dominatrix uh, yeah a bit actually there's there's no immediate red flags you have to judge a woman on who she is and that's what's so troublesome with all these dating apps is that you have to get to know a girl for who she is and just one or two bro, conversations back and forth are such bullshit. bro when they looking for some fucking it's easy to spot. Like, it's easy to spot. There's no girl on any dating app that's looking for yeah. They're either there genuinely or they're like, fucking no. right. They're fucking prostitutes. No. You're white. You can't spot that shit. Obviously, you can't. There's, there's, Red flag on dating apps. If they have any sort of social media listed, Instagram, Snapchat, they're a Yo. bot or they're a prostitute. Yo, that's good. That's actually good. Yeah. If she has her Insta on there, she yeah. just wants the followers. Nope. No. Yeah. No, red flag. Best pickup line. Ooh, hey, hey, hey. Best pickup line, real quick. Hey, excuse me, are you an orange? And then immediately say, oh no, I'm sorry. You're definitely a cutie. It works like one out of if, 20. If you, <laughs> I, can't say, no, I can't even say no, bro. That that was trash. He has Bad Bunny as his music. You know, as oh. his, you know when you tag music? Toxico. Yeah, if you had Bad Bunny as your music, you're toxic as <laughs> Just trying to get yeah, to know. <laughs> Another red flag is like looking for someone to chat with. That's a red flag. Kill it. All right. What a pickup line that got me. If you were, if you were a vegetable, you'd be a cute cumber. <laughs> That's kind of cute. That really got me. Have y'all used like Tinder or Bumble before? You have, right? I've used it too. Let me, hey, that's the trenches sometimes. Let me tell you. is the trenches, for real. <laughs> you find all the hoes on there, I swear to God. <laughs> I'm from the trenches, I don't know how I get it. Oh, you got kitty, I mean, I, yeah, let's get it. What is like your worst dating experience using like Tinder or Bumble? Or like the worst thing you've been... Oh, God.
god. <laughs> well, I only ever linked with one guy, and that shit lasted like two years, and then it was like, yeah. rap. Rap. What? Why? Because he was a cheater. Oh. I mean, Tinder is used for like Tinder, you feel me? So I was out of state, right? And then. <laughs> oh, he cheated. Oh, no, he cheated. He he's, he's, cheated. he's, he's, he's. He cheated. Wait, what? You did? No, I didn't cheat. Bro, I didn't know. I was out of state. I can smell something fishy. <laughs> something fishy going on. My worst dating Tinder experience, right? So I linked up with this girl, bro. I thought she was cool, right? Oh, we went shit. out, we went oh. out for a couple drinks. And I was like, all right, bet it's going to be whatever. Bro, so I get there, right? Bro, she. She did not look like her picture. I swear Cat to fish? God, had pictures. How big? How big of a difference was it? Bro, it was like it was like if you compared one to a thousand. Like obviously, there's like three zeros behind a thousand. I pulled out Tinder. I was like, "This is you. Don't lie to me. This is you." If a guy like moans like really loudly, it's hot. It's hot? Okay. Wait, no, no. It depends how. Like, yeah. what do you mean? How? Like how? Can I show you? I want you to picture like eye contact, right? Like you're in there. Okay. If I'm in there, I want you to tell me if this is hot. Hey Mario, you gotta be like. Oh. If you're on your first date, right? Let's say you're on Tinder or Bumble. Yeah. First date. If he's a ten, right? Are you gonna let him hit without one of these? With I I can't use no rubber. I'm allergic to latex. I'm allergic okay. To latex. It gotta be raw, and I gotta know you clean, okay? And on my wife, on my wife, I go raw. I, I don't. <laughs> It, it, it got to, it got to be without it. It's straight dick. Long as your arm thick as your wrist, that's dick. <laughs> Are you giving short guys a chance? Oh, always. I love short guys. I don't actually care about height one way or another. I do always date tall guys, but I'll give a short guy okay, a chance. Okay, fair enough. Tamales are the best. If she can't make tamales, if she can't make tamales, she can't cook at all. Hell when no. the she ain't good at all. <laughs> Would you rather her know how to cook fire ass tamales or give fire ass head, bro? I need to eat the f <laughs> head, nigga. I need to eat. Your f just gonna starve. That is good. It looks like a carcass, but it is good. I got gifted a tamale. Want me to rate it? Want me to rate it? Was that a yes? Uh, I'm gonna give it eight seven, bro. Eight seven. Have you ever gotten head while you've been eating, bro? A lot of times. Yeah. Have you ever had a throw up on your dick while she was sucking? Yeah. Really, really slob. Jump that ass around the shower. You know what I said? It was like, no, nah, you yeah. know it is. <laughs> yeah. He know what it is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, hey, hey. What is like your biggest red flag or biggest turnoff if you were on Tinder or Bumble? When the hoes be like, I'm not here for a sneaky link. Yes, you are, bitch. Yeah, yeah, you, you are. are. Yeah, you are. Try to f they own yeah, you. Yeah, are. Yeah, you are. Or, or when they be like, just trying to make friends. What the f oh, you on yeah, Tinder for? No, you're not. Who you're goes on Tinder? Trying to get some dick. Who yeah. goes on Tinder to make hey, friends? Hey, 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 don't give me the blues clues. Don't give me the blues you clues. A little bit of honesty, and I'll give and you some good coochie. Yeah. That's some good coochie. Yeah. That's all I got. It gotta be good. It can be mid. It can be mid for real. Life. You meet up with a girl from Tinder, and you're in there. If it's loose, are you still? Are you? Is that? Finish the job. You gotta finish that job. You don't, hey, you don't quit when you start it. Finish the plate, man. Finish your plate. Finish your plate. But if it stank, stank though, that's then a different story. Go. Then you gotta go. That's then you gotta story. go. Do y'all have any like lines, like your best Tinder line or best pickup line that you would use for a girl? I want you to ruin my life. They go that's for it. They go for it. Hey, they go for it. Hey, I pick, I pick whatever holiday it is. So if it's like Thanksgiving, I'm like, you know, all this Thanksgiving spirits really make me think how blessed I am to find you. You know what I mean? What's your snap? You know what I mean? Same thing with Christmas. He's a Rizzly bear. That's the Rizzly bear. Yo. Riz Khalifa, Riz Khalifa. Bro, that's a clean shirt. If, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. If you're on Tinder and she's an absolute 10, first date and she wants you to hit it without a condom, are you going to? Hit it raw, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm coming in that, you know what I mean? <laughs> Good time, bro. Every time. You know what like mean? Swimwear, baby, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They call me Michael Phelps. Because I'll be out here swimming. What is like your biggest absolute Biggest red flag in a female, bro. When she don't want to share. Like share her friends with you? Yeah. Like threesome? Or yeah, bro. Whenever, whenever she don't want to share, bro. It's like, hey, it's a city boy, city boy. On Tinder, um, they got their tits hanging out, man. Come on. Really? 
That's a green flag. That's a green no. flag. That's a red flag. <laughs> if you want something serious, that ain't no green flag. Come uh, on. That's fair enough. Yeah, that's yeah, fair yeah, enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If, you don't want your girl going out to a bar getting hit on by other men? Come if, on, if you just If you want a midnight snack, then that's acceptable. What's like your worst Tinder experience or Bumble experience? Like on your first date, worst experience? Uh, I've never been on a date, period. What? Yeah. You're so Isn't that crazy? <laughs> She's never been on a date, seriously. That's my sister. I want to say good job, I think for like locking it down maybe like being picky like finding the right person if she's an absolute 10 right if they're an absolute 10 are you gonna hit on the first date if she wants to f she wants to f okay uh, i'm just saying okay because i'll f yeah. throw that shit down okay yeah. all right i'm just saying all right it's up to her okay i'm not gonna force nothing okay but because i'm a gentleman like that okay is sex better with or without a condom and if you met her on tinder and she tells you to hit it with no condom are you going to we're well, talking a 10. well well here's the thing i've already How's hit your it pull out game well here's the pull thing game, well here's the game, thing she wanted me to come inside of her so i already did so it don't even matter okay <laughs> <laughs> what's your biggest biggest f***ing red flag in a female let's say you're on tinder or something on your first date she got a she got a print in her pants print like if she has like, like print she got a print in her pants she's slanging lumber i don't want to go yeah. under <laughs> It's like a lumber, I can't go under. Yeah. Have you ever been in a situation where like you get catfished? Like she shows up. Oh no. Oh we at the I will not. Listen, if a woman cannot cook, is that a deal breaker? Hell nah, we Uber eating. What are you talking about? <laughs> we Uber eating. Uh, everything, every, everything come to us. We not wife and nothing, no. She we Uber eating everything. He said Uber eats a side piece. That's what she Uber eating everything. <laughs> On Tinder, right? What's the biggest red flag? Any when she saw her keys, yeah, when she saw her keys. If I see your cash app, that's weird. I feel like that's like panhandling in front of the store with a cup. A cash app on your profile. Yeah, because you're just asking for like, you know? What are you doing? Yeah. What are you doing? You're, you're, you're panhandling. Oh, all right. I want you to tell me, right? If you're on Tinder, you meet a girl. If it's the first date you just met this girl, are you going to hit it with no condom if she wants you to? 100%. <laughs> I, mean, yeah. I, mean, I mean, professionally, professionally, we know the answer. But I'm going to say no. What is like your, your worst or craziest Tinder experience that you've had? Oh, this. yeah, we got one. <laughs> Dude, I went to this one girl's place, man, and um, she was cool and all. We were watching a show, oh, and next thing you know, I ended up with handcuffs on me. Yo! <laughs> Dude, I got scared. Like, I was like, I couldn't get away type shit. Did she have you on, like, the bed post? Yes! Yo! <laughs> all right, be honest, though. Are the handcuffs in play? Like, are the handcuffs something that you're actually into? Um, at the time, no, because it was a hookup, because I was like, uh, I was scared of that shit. But now, I'm in a relationship. Yes, yes that, uh, it's a real thing now. <laughs> But in, as a tender relationship, no, f that shit. Dude. That was scary as fuck. My wife and I have been together oh, for well. 35 years. And on our first date, she took me out on my birthday. And this is a true story. I actually farted as I got it out of the car on our first date. That's a way to make an entrance right there. Look, and I knew that if I called her the next day, Izzy, and she answered the phone, we were pretty f***ing solid. That's one way to be remembered. Oh, absolutely. It was great. <laughs> Forward, Tasis. Good to meet you. So I have a question. What's like your worst dating experience that you've been on? Oh man, I showed up. I showed up to this like small town country bar. Yeah. And she was like a dirty little Mexican girl. This feels kind of racist. I'm sorry. I, I, I hate to say like I love Mexican girls, but like it's like she's like Mexican, Mexican. <laughs> and she was some sombrero. Let's just say we couldn't we couldn't talk because she was like full on Mexican. Oh. That's a fire. Hey, appreciate you, bro. Hey.